Recently, I have showed how to install CacheOS on your computer, but after you have installed CacheOS, what's next? Hello guys and welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you the first steps you want to take after you have installed CacheOS on your computer, or even if you're using CacheOS for a while. I will show you how to update CacheOS using the terminal, so let's get started. But before we start, if you're first time to the channel, please take a second to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss new videos. Also, if you like this video and it was helpful for you, please support with your like, I appreciate it very much. Without further ado, let's get started. The very first thing you should do after installing CacheOS is update your system. Even though you just installed it, there might already be newer versions of packages, security patches or bug fixes available. So why do we need to update? Get the latest security patches, fix potential bugs, ensure system stability and performance. Updating your system in CacheOS is super easy. Just open the terminal by pressing Ctrl Alt plus T. In the terminal type this command sudo space pacman space dash capital S YU and press enter. It will ask you for your password this is the password that you have set up during the installation. If you haven't set up a separate password for your user account and your administrator account, then it will be the only password that you have assigned during the installation process. So just type in your password and press enter. For security reasons, the password is not visible at all. Even though you type in, there is nothing going to be on the screen, but it's still working. So just type in your password and press enter. This will fetch the latest updates for your system and install them. As you can see, it has found 573 megabyte to download. To proceed with the installation, simply type Y and press enter. This will install all the updates. Depending on your internet speed and the size of the updates, it should only take a minute or two. It has actually taken me 3 minutes and 50 seconds. I had quite a few updates apparently. And as you can see, I got the sign here reboot recommended due to the update of core system packages. So if you see that sign, go ahead and type sudo reboot and press enter. This will reboot your system and apply all the updates installed. All right, there we go. The updates are installed. If you're using the AUR Arc user repository, which is common for extra software, you should also update your AUR packages. CacheOS comes with Paru, a fast and easy to use AUR helper. To update everything including AUR packages, run Paru space dash capital S Y U and press enter. Enter your password, press enter. And as you can see, there is nothing to do. Once the update finishes, you're all set. Your system is now running on the latest and greatest version of CacheOS. A quick tip, if you ever see a prompt asking about package conflicts or config file changes, read the message carefully before proceeding. Most of the time, pressing enter to accept the default option is fine, but it's always good to double check. All right, that's it guys for today. I hope you find this video helpful. If you like it, please support it with your like. If you're first time to the channel and would like to see and learn more about Linux, Please take a second to click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you don't miss new videos. Also, if you still have questions, comments, drop them down in the comment section below. I'll try to help you if I can. But this is it for today. I hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.